What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kendra, and I'm back with another video. It's been a minute, y'all. It's really been a minute since I did a video. Your girl been kind of busy, but I'm not even about to sit here and try to make no excuses. I'm trying to get back to it. I'm trying to be consistent, all that stuff. So if you are new here, um, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Hit the like button. It helps your girl's videos out. So I would really appreciate if y'all do that. And we about to just hop right into the video. So as y'all could tell by the title, I'm not wearing the hair anymore because child is a hot mess. I can't. So I'm going to be doing a two month update on this hair that, I, that was sent to me um, a while ago. But I reviewed it on my channel two months ago. So this is a two month update. And she just... The reason why y'all don't, don't like don't mind my hair stuff. I'm not finished with it. I'm just trying to get this video out but the reason that um i'm doing this two month update is because i've noticed that that video is like slowly but surely going up i think it's like almost at 2,000 views so thank you to everybody like that watched that video she's slowly but surely climbing or whatever i think i feel like i did a good job on the video or whatever and don't get me wrong initially the hair was on point like the hair was on point the wig was on point i slayed it I was serving you silk press. Sis was giving the girls silk press. She was giving the girls natural. She was giving the girls growing shit out of my scalp. But over time, how do I say this? Sis was tangling. Sis was shedding. Sis started to get stiff. Um, part of the reason this could be is because this hair was like a kinky texture wig. So I feel like it already need more attention, care, love, just like your natural hair would. And on top of that, I was putting heat on the hair almost every day. So I am going to make that disclaimer. Like I ain't just going to fully blame the wig's performance. But for the most part, I feel like it was the wig's performance because <laughs> I only had the wig for two months. I didn't wear it for two months. I wore it. Um, how long did I wear it? I'm really not sure. I just know I had it in around like around Christmas. Two months ago was December. So I probably wore it for like two or three weeks, maybe two and a half weeks. Sis was bomb or whatever, but like I said, I had, oh, you know, just ignore my hair. I'm not finished. I just took the scarf off of it and that's it. Disregard my appearance. We're here for this. So yeah, um, I had her in for like a minute and then I took the wig out or whatever. Um, I think like last week I decided to reinstall this wig. So I washed it. Sis. That's the worst. Like washing it literally like made the shedding worse. And I kind of feel bad. And I, I mean I don't feel bad because like the wig is what it is. But don't get me wrong, like this hair company was super sweet. The person that I was contacting, like the lady, she was so sweet during the entire process. She was asking me to give her feedback and everything. And it's like I hadn't worn a wig long enough to give her any feedback. But um, yeah, it's like it's Finjan Hair Company on Amazon. They was super sweet. But I'm just here to really tell y'all to tea on this wig because I don't want y'all to buy it and spend y'all money. And then you not get what's kind of expected out of a wig. I feel like if a wig don't last you a few months, it's not a good wig. That's just period. Because I've had wigs that have lasted me years. Well, I'm going to say it's only really one hair company that's like last me for years. And that's True Glory Hair. That's the only hair that I really will spend my own money on, to be honest. And I've been rocking with them for years. But other than that, like a good wig should be able to last you some months. I would say six months, past six months. That's how you know you got a good wig. And like, she didn't do that. But this is the wig now. And as y'all can see, she's a stiff. Um, but literally, like, I'm running my hands through it now. I don't know if y'all can see that, but that's like a strand of hair right here. I wore her in the... If y'all watched my everyday makeup tutorial, y'all saw this wig. And if y'all watched the initial video of me styling this, then y'all would see how the wig looked on. I'm going to put it in the eye cards. Um, but I wore her like in a half up, half down kind of hairstyle, which was super duper cute. Um, sis was serving a Girl Scout. She most definitely was. But my only thing is like throughout the day, I would I noticed that like when I was at work and stuff like that, I would have to run my hands through the hair like it would start getting stiff and we don't 
we don't do stiff. Like I shouldn't have to be working worrying about is my hair sticking up right now. Like that's not that's not cute at all. So I gave her three days. And I said, okay, she's she's a done deal. This is what the nape looks like, y'all. I cannot make this up. This is what the neck of the hair look like. This is what I mean by it tangling in the nape. Like, and this is already a kinky like texture wig. But do y'all see this? Like, I'm not, I can't run my hands through this. So yeah, I mean, when it came to the lace and everything and like the actual like lace she's she was solid like she's she's good it's just the hair really like it shed a lot especially when i washed it and she tangled like and she's dry um i actually put natural hair products in this hair just because um i didn't put anything in it when i blow dried it which i should have like usually when i blow dry my natural hair um i put some type of product in it then i blow dry it. i didn't do that with this wig and you could definitely tell because when i got done blow drying it it was super duper dry so i actually put like shea moisture products and stuff in this hair to get it like soft and manageable because it, it's literally like it literally acts like natural hair but other than that like she not super bad um if you just looking for like a temporary hairstyle like this is a great wig if you're just looking for a temporary wig and you want something to look natural like um your natural texture hair if you got like type 4 hair or whatever or 4b 4c type hair or whatever and you just looking for like a natural wig this is great for that but i just want to tell y'all like this is not gonna last don't don't buy this wig if you're looking for it to last like past a month especially with you like having to restyle it like I would put my bonnet on and my scarf and everything and the next day I would have to restyle it because hello I, I slept on it so when it came time to put like you know heat and stuff in it that's probably another thing like that probably that probably kills this off a little bit even more like with just me putting the heat on it, like almost every day I was wearing it but she still was giving the girls like natural like scalp look at this like it like i'm holding somebody's scalp in my hand so yeah i really just wanted to make this update because this is what i noticed like while wearing this wig i tried to get sis a second install and she just i couldn't do it for no more than three days like sis had to come out i just couldn't do the stiffness like she don't look that bad on camera right now but sis was just giving me like she's lifeless now like, I don't want to deal with this, like, tangling in the neck, having to go brush my hair every 30 minutes. I'm not doing that. Like, I should be able to just wear my hair. Like, this hair is bomb, y'all. Long key hair. I've been had this hair. I reviewed it Valentine's Like, I did, like, a Valentine's Day look before Valentine's Day. And it's still February. So, we gonna give her some time. But so far, like, I didn't wash the hair. The hair wasn't falling out while I was washing it. You feel me? Like the frontal wasn't balding as i was washing it like what was happening in this wig but yeah i just wanted to say that but yeah um that's basically all i have to say about this wig um so i do recommend it only if you just look at something temporary and this wig is 100 it's retail for 117 dollars on amazon um like i said the company was super nice i really liked working with this company but I'm still gonna keep it a buck 50 on my channel like I'm not about to be um just doing hair reviews and like saying that the hair is good if it's not you feel like I just can't like Keandra and phoniness just it'll never mix so um if I do do an initial v review of course that's what I might start changing my like I might start changing my reviews of like wearing a hair like don't quote me but I, I might start doing it like just wear the hair for a week and then review it because I feel like initially all hair look good when it come out the freaking box or when it comes out of the pla the bag or the box like all hair look good of course it's gonna look silky and all this stuff but how does the hair hold up while you're wearing it like how does it hold up after a month two months so let me know if y'all interested in me um or like what I should do when it comes to my hair reviews do y'all think I should just 
um keep doing initial reviews and then just update y'all or should i just wear the hair for a week and then review you feel me like i want to know how what y'all think make sure you drop a comment in the um comment section down below but yeah i just wanted to come up here and update y'all because i'm like hold on like my video is slowly like it's going up there like a thousand almost two thousand people that's enough people you feel me so like i don't know i just don't want nobody to and get to hear and be like hold on sis was lying like <laughs> this is not that like if i'm gonna review something i'm gonna keep it above 50 like i said i'm gonna be honest with y'all because if i was spending my own hard-earned money on it like i'm gonna need to know the tea and the full tea the truth and nothing but the truth so yeah with that being said this is the end of this video sis is i think sis is done i don't know I don't know like I, I tried to get this another shot but yeah that is the end of this video if y'all like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you like the video to let me know you was messing with it and it'll help me out like I said um subscribe hit the bell for post notifications and make sure you go check out the initial review um of this wig because she was bomb like when I first installed her so if y'all haven't watched it like I said I'm gonna leave it in the iCards I'm gonna also link it in the description down below and with that being said, I'ma see y'all in my next video.